Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to the Monster Hunter World LP. Now, every one of these episodes, we will start with upgrading our equipment. Now, I went ahead and killed a few more of them, uh, Jagarasai, Jag Jagarai, <laughs> so we can get the materials required in order to make a full Jagara set, which is exactly what I want to do right meow. Or not. Excuse me for a second. Just give me you stupid Jagara scale so I can finish upgrading this stupid set. <clears throat> there we go. That's see, I had it. I just had to just had to find it. I just had to find the last piece. That's all. Got it. All right, full Jagger set. Now we're not going to do this every time. Uh, upgrading to the full set of the monster we just killed. However, considering it's a four times upgrade for defense, eh, kind of necessary, I think, in the early game to get that full Jagger set. Definitely helps. Now we have to go talk to the provisions manager, resource center. Oh, nah, uh, yada 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 yada. Yada yada, plenty of work for us. Yada yada, they give us work. Okay, yeah, they make sure everybody works. Got it. Got it. Find us a viable campsite. Okay, establish a campsite for them. All right, that's fine. Seems like a side quest thing, but you know, whatever. That's where you get all your bounties and crap. Actually, I probably should set the bounties while I'm here. Okay. Now we must find the campsite in the ancient Anth forest. Expedition on this is we must find the campsite that they need. Ha ha ha. <laughs> what do you have to say about this quest, handler? Uh, you're just telling us how to do expeditions. Cool. Thanks. I don't know what that accent was that I did before, by the way. Uh, as a, uh, p uh, point to show you again, uh, we have a wish list here. We'll be using this a few times. This we will use to mark the next weapon in the tree so we know when we get that question mark, question mark, question mark material that is on the top there to upgrade our weapon further. Now then, let us, what? Oh, expeditions, expeditions, yeah, how to do this crap. So, we have to go look for that campsite. I'm not quite sure where they want us to head here. Actually, let's go ahead and throw a marker on Your that. There should be a thing somewhere. Where you are and where the scout flies are uh, you. you can also use it to keep tabs on monsters. Don't see one. They tell me how to use the scout flies. There's a dude up here, though. Oh, wait, there it is. This is what we want. That's what we want to mark. Let's get going. These spiky tail bastards. Look at them. They think they're so good. I've never, ever seen one of those attack me, except for the one time that I did while I was killing those Jagras. That's... Surprising, I guess. You see something new every time when you play this game. That's how alive this world is. Hey, buddy. What are you, what are you doing? You're, howdy. you're out here. Howdy. How's the hunting going? Nothing better than to spend the day fishing. The commission put him in charge of studying the fish. He loves it. All right. Uh, he'd already cut every fish in the old last wor last old world. Jesus. Wow. Uh, Okie dokie. Called it chumming as opposed to fishing. Uh, do I want to fish? Um, no. I'm, I'm good. I really... I'm not a fisherman. I... <laughs> Some people like to fish. I'm not a big fan. Seems like a waste of time to me. If you, I don't know. You guys like to fish? I don't know. Let me know down in the comments below. You much of fisherman? You angle? You do a little fly fishing? Tie your own flies? That's some cool shit. I don't know. This is what we call padding while I'm running and looking at nothing. It's it's a fine art to be entertaining and have nothing to look at. You guys don't even know. Well, maybe you do. If you guys make videos, you probably know all about this padding thing that I'm going to be doing. Maybe a little bit of here in this LP. Uh, I will try to cut out the boring crap, which... Uh, case in point, I mean, <laughs> come on, I'm just running through the forest. He's not far ahead. He's, he's right up here. I probably should be gathering these footprints as I walk by him. Why is there a guy just out here in the middle of the wilderness? Or a girl. Is that a girl? Yeah, full pukey puke set on her. Oh, that's, that's cute. That's a cute little set. Hey, uh, fancy meeting you. You're in charge of the field guide. Cool. That's the thing we use to decide what kind of weaknesses our enemies have. Yep, capture, observe, study, all that fun stuff. There's all kinds of undiscovered specimens here. Oh, you want me to become your assistant, do you? You want me to capture endemic animals? Endemic? Is that the word? That's not the right word. Let us go over to our capture net yonder. That's what we want. She told us to uh, capture something, so let's let's go ahead and do this little mini quest while we're here. I'm not sure what we see. she said to capture, and I'm not even sure if I have the quest active. Let's grab these footprints, too, because I just keep running past them. I don't even know what that footprint is for. I'm, what am I looking for? I'm looking for one of those. That's what I'm looking for. Crawl up this mushroom, please. Hey. Hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, you. You, you, come here. Yeah. Did I, did I get him? I missed him. Where, where are you flying to? Come here. Hey, you, you. Damn it. I am a terrible aim. Te he flew over here. Flew oh, there's a bigger one. Flew over here. Hey. Yeah. Did I get him? No. Fuck. This is hard. Come here. Quit running away. Ah. Ha <laughs> ha. Gotcha. You little bugger. All right. Now let's head to where that campsite is supposed to be. Or we can... What? Why is it telling us to go back and talk to you again? I don't think we need to talk to you again, but... I'll do it anyway. Oh goody, you already caught it. Yada 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 yada. She has one too. 
Okie dokie. Oh, well, I guess I should talk to you twice, but I guess, I think it actually triggered because I already caught one. Uh, yeah, yeah, it certainly did. Oh, well, just, <laughs> excuse me while I crouch away from you and walk out. That was the fancy way to do it. Hey, Big Buster Sword Buddy, what you doing here? Looks like a place they want us to make camp is right up there, huh? They picked a pretty nice spot. I don't know, I haven't looked at it yet. Let's take a gander, shall we? Uh-huh. Uh, mm -hmm. The scout flies disappeared. Oh, nice, beautiful shot. You can actually see my scar in the nighttime skies. And the obvious appearance of freckles. Hey, buddy, what are you, uh, what you, uh, doing some gardening? Oh, what you got there, a vase? A vase? Uh-huh. Hey, Kula Yaku. How you, how you hanging out? How you, how you doing, buddy? Oh, watch out! Look out, that vase is big. Wow, that vase was as big as us, and he was carrying it. <laughs> as he scampers away. <laughs> what was that about? Why, why, why was there a Kula Yaku hanging out here? destination for your scout flies on the map. Oh, okay. Why would you tell me that now? If we don't take care of that We're gonna past, have to take care of that past. Tonight. Okay. Oh, yeah. oh, she didn't pronounce it. I was hoping she would pronounce it. Kulaku. Cool. Interesting. Interesting. So we must mark <laughs> bird brain bandit. An assignment. Do I need to, uh... Do I need to go back or can I just mark him and take care of him right now? Can I take care of him right now? Is that a thing? Uh, yeah, we can do it now. Cool. Excellent. Let's go hunt us a Kulaku. 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 Why am I? Wow, I cannot platform. This game, it, mm, it has an auto run mechanic that makes platforming question mark difficult for sure. You kind of just, you kind of just jump off of ledges occasionally, especially when you're using the vines, such as we're gonna see right here. Yeah. If you miss or aren't lined up properly, it's kind of forgiving. But if you aren't lined up properly, it can be difficult. Yep. Uh oh. Well. I guess that works too. Oh, there's poison cups down here. I do not like that there's poison cups here. Hey, buddy, let's go ahead and grab some of your feathers. Or scrape your feathers into some sort of <laughs> water bottle container. I don't, I don't know what that was. Just scraping feathers. Don't mind me. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? You look you look good. You've been uh, you've been working out, losing weight, and you're a very feathery dinosaur. All right, that's enough looking at you. Time time to attack. Time to attack. Pretty pretty please. Time to attack. Why are you not? All right, look, game. There it is. That's what I wanted. Bring out the bug, pretty please. All right, we're not hitting him in the face. My, my goal was to hit him in the face. Hit him in the butt. That's what I want. And pop the poison on him. Or don't pop the poison. There it goes. What is with my buttons here? They're not responding like they should. Pop the poison. That's what I want. So when he runs away... Oh, shit, there's poison cups here. Nope, get out of the poison cups. Pretty please. Switch this over to my antidote. The bottom right of the screen, I was switching my items that I'm using. Get him out of that poison cloud there. I do. There's On the ground over there, there's like a black spot. If we... Ah, crap. If we walk into that, we will get poisoned and... Poison in this game is very bad uh, for me. Uh, very good if you can get it on monsters. Ah, there we go. Is he holding something? He is holding a rock, isn't he? Do I have anything in my slinger that I can use? Uh, no, I don't. Huh. Well, I guess we're going to have to do it this way then. Uh, normally I would be boosting right away, but I figured you'd pick something up. So, yeah, that's that. Come here, bug. Let's go ahead and just boost while he's got a rock in his hands, shall we? Uh, well, that missed. Let's try this again. Boost. That's another white. We don't want that. That's a red. I'll take that red, thank you. Need a body hit. Body hit. Nope, not quite a body hit. Body hit? Nope. Body hit. Alright, that's enough of that. We'll just get some stabbies. Or he's fucking off. Okay, that's fine too. Ah, poison cups. Do not run into the poison cups. They will suck. For sure. There's some blue mushrooms here. Or some toadstools. I'm not... Those aren't the poison ones. Uh, eh. I need some slinger ammo, so keep an eye out. Keep an eye out, Ezra. Look at his... Oh, I thought there was feathers falling down. No, there were his feathers falling down. Keep an eye out for the slinger ammo that we're going to need. That's one right there. Red pit. That's what I want. That's how we get him to drop his little uh, rock that he's holding on to. Which uh, is almost necessary for fighting these things, I think. Hey. Hey, you. Hey, you. Put that rock down. Put that rock down. Where, what are you, where are you going here? Ah, it's a paralyzing toad. Jump into it, too. You get paralyzed, too. There. <laughs> That's beautiful. I love it. Uh, can I get a... No, I'm not going to try and get a body boost. I am going to bring out some poison, though, because it's going to come in handy for these uh, monsters that I'm not quite weapon for, I think. Oh, yeah, getting a decent amount of damage done. He dropped the material there that I can see. Might need to make it a point to pick that up. For sure. Don't grab another thing. Just sit, just stand there and just take it. Just take it like a man. Take it like a man. Oh, boy, he is being very cooperative. Oh, well, he was being very cooperative. Yep. Poison. Yes, getting some nice... Ooh, poison damage down on him. Ooh, part, broke another part. What did I break? His beak? Maybe. I think I was hitting him in the head there. That works for me. Uh, I'm not sure if you can sever this guy's tail or that we would necessarily want to. My red boost has worn out now. My weapon needs sharpened. Come here. Face me. 
Face me, bro. No, he's going to pick up something. Get a red boost. Oh, that's an orange boost. I'll take that. Oh, yes. I will take that. Pull a red one? Nope. Nope, he's fucking off. Okay. Let's pick this up. What is it? What are we picking up here? A wyvern tier. Oh, it's just worth research points, apparently. Well, that's something. Grab some more red pits as we follow him down, as we do. Didn't really get a chance to use him there because I hit that paralyzing toad on accident. Need to sharpen my weapon. Go ahead and give a scrapey scrape. Hit that paralyzed toad. I didn't know it was there. Uh, I honestly thought paralyzing... Oh, there's a freaking uh, great Jagoras down there as well fighting something. I didn't know that there were paralyzed toads in the forest, so I wasn't really ready for it. Why are you fighting the Jagoras? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you, you little T-Rex wannabe? Get out of there. Get out. What? Why are you in the ground now? Oh, missed that hit, didn't I? He has a rock. Here we go. Okay, now is an opportunity to do this. Drop the rock. Drop the rock. Drop it. Drop it. Drop the rock. There you go. That's what I wanted. Yep. Get the get the weapon out real quick. Yeah. No, I don't want the Jagras. Don't fight the Jagras. Follow him. Follow this one. This is our target. Actually, he has a nice weapon tree uh, when you get his materials. So, mm, considering how early on it is and the current weapon tree we, uh, that I want to go down requires materials from the next area. So I'm not sure. It depends which one comes first. We'll see what opens up after I kill this guy. I'm not really sure. There's some nice ore mining areas there. He's crouching under this, so we'll use that opportunity to get a nice hit on his tail. Hee hee hee. Get a little tail jab in there. Tail jabs. If you break his tail, I think you have the opportunity to pick up tail parts from him, which will be useful in crafting for sure. Bust out the bug real quick. And target the bug on him. There we go. Bug, hit him. Hit him, bug. Hit bug. Bug, please. Ouch. That actually kind of hurt a little bit. Even with full, uh... Yeah. Full Jagras parts. Ooh, there's a red boost. Megusta. Get a white boost off of him, maybe. White boost. White boost, please. White boost, please. Uh, there. No, that's another red. Alright, well, we're just gonna have to roll with this. Uh, should I mount this one? He is really hard to mount because he's, like, tiny. Ooh, got it. Took a hit there, but it didn't do much damage. There we go. Get behind him and start hitting that soft, squishy little tail part. Oh, yes. For tons of damage coming. Oh, he picked up another rock. Dirty bastard. Why you gotta pick up rocks, dude? Why you gotta pick up rocks? Huh? Huh? I think some people don't know that you can actually just shoot him to make him drop those rocks. I think it's a uh, very... Come on. Don't don't make a liar out of me, dude. Oh, well, it helps if you hit him. Don't make a liar out of me. There we go. That's what I wanted. Get rid of those rocks so you're not constantly binging your weapon off of it, which is very annoying for sure. <laughs> Especially with this guy. He's not very hard at a low level, but once you get a little bit higher, it can take some serious time and hits to get him down. And uh, you don't want that rock in the way for sure. Ooh, sick backflip there. And it turned around my hits. Uh... Does that backflip have tracking on it? Not many things as far as attacks go on this. He didn't pick anything up. He was stopped out of the pickup animation. Gonna go ahead and pick up these piercing pods. It is a piercing pods that he dropped. Because we can do something fun here. We should be able... I need to sharpen my weapon first. Jump up there. Uh, I'm not gonna get a chance to use the piercing pods in the way I want. But they will come in handy when he starts picking crap up. Which he always does. He always picks stuff up. Uh, ideally, I think you would want to aim for his head, but he has a few attacks that he likes to bring out when you're facing in front of him, so I don't know. Maybe it's more advantageous to stay off to his side like I've been doing. I'm not entirely sure. Oh, we might be able to get a uh, use of this in. There we go. It should stop him, hopefully, and then I can get a hit off or two while he uh, decides what he's doing. He should try and pick something up almost immediately going into that animation. Is he? Is he? What are you doing? What are you going to do? He's just going just gonna to yell at me with his little like, growls. Full weapon sharpness. I don't have any boosts on, but I'm going to try and get that out before... There we go. Before he picks up a rock, and then we can just uh, drop that rock. Hey, that works really, really well. And we'll pop out this thing right here. There we go. And we'll start pulling boosts. Uh, what are you going to be? Red one right away. That's good. Useful. Now that's another red one. Don't want that. There's a white one. Can I get an orange? Oranges on these small monsters are difficult, to say the least. Uh oh he's running away again. Hey. Hey. No, 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 no. Oh, is that going to hit? It is not going to hit. Damn. Just around the corner on that. Come here, buddy. Come here. Quit your, uh, quit your running away. I don't, we don't have time for this. We don't have time for this, your, your, your needy running away bullshit. Oh, I'm out of piercing pods. Crap. Probably something I should pay attention to. I probably can catch up to him and get a spin attack on him. Or a sheath attack, I should say. Right about yonder. Yeah, getting hit on the tail and stun him. Cool. Cool. Got a nice stun off that. Going to get a few more hits for sure. Uh... Need I, oof. I was gonna say I need to get a, a nice weak spot, but I think he's almost dead. Ooh, boy! Don't pick anything up. No, no, stop it, stop it, stop it! I'm out of piercing pods. I don't. Ooh, he almost hit me with that. The uh, fuck. The attacks that he does with the rock are actually really good. As in they, ouch! As in they can really hurt you. Just avoid that rock with my blade, ideally. Hey, and I got him. Perfect. Sheath the weapon, pretty please, and pick up whatever he dropped here. What did he? What was that?
That's another wyvern tier. Cool, more research points. I love that crap. That was a bounty for a monster hunt. And we rebuilt the ancient forest camp. Cool, cool, cool. Gonna pick up this guy's crap. We'll go back into town and, uh, well... I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna have an option for upgrades or not. Maybe. Let's let's go take a look and see what they want next, huh? Took care of that business. Thank you for making sure the campsite is safe. Hey, no, no problem. They went ahead and set up camp for us. Awesome. Now she knows I can get shit did. I can get shit did for shizzy. What else do you want? Yep, yep, yep. The pleasantries aside, what else do you want? Stop it. Stop it. I didn't read any of that. Uh, do wants me to make a mega potion. I get dice steak out of it. Thanks, I guess? I don't know. Ooh, the situation room has a situation to situation in the room. What do you want to know, big dog? What's up with... Oh, well, we gotta walk around to you, I guess. What do you want to know, buddy? What do you... What, Commander? What? Yeah, thank you. I cleared out that camp for you guys. Yeah, that's nice. Now the hunt for the pukey pukey is on. Yeah, now we'll be able to look closer at that evidence we found. He can't stress enough how vital it is to take out that pukey pukey for the commission. Good luck and be careful, he says. Well, that's interesting. There we go. Now we have the pukey pukey mission. But first, let's go take a look at the upgrades on this weapon. See maybe if that Kulayaku tree is quicker to get to the next tier of weapon or not. Because if it is, that means we can get more damage done earlier than we would be able to on the... Well, this one. Whatever this is, it doesn't tell you. Ah, there's the Kula Yaku blade. That's cool. What's the other one? This is the Pukey Puke down here. Sorry, I wish I had a pointer. See my little pointer here? Down here is the Pukey Puke tree, and up here is the Kula Yaku tree. Hmm. So I suppose this would be quicker access to the next weapon variety. So we'll go ahead and just do that right now, yeah? Yeah. There it is, the nice bird-beaked weapon. It actually does have a bird beak on it. Hold on, I'll show you that in a second. Ah, the next tier of that tree. Let's go ahead and throw this in the uh, favorites. So we can uh, keep track of when we'll have access to the upgrade. If it comes before this one, then well, maybe we'll go down this tree first. I don't know. But guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Monster Hunter. Let me know what you think down in the comments below. As usual, we got a few upgrades. Next time we'll go hunt us a pukey puke. So uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.